Well, the winter weather, as you saw there, is settling yeah. in, and that means plenty of people are cranking up the heat, especially if you're living in the high country. Yeah, and this is the age-old question, right? When it comes to your electric bill, is it better to keep the heat on or to turn it completely off when you leave your home? Here's Team 12's Adam Longo, who's verifying this for us this morning. Social media sites are super highways of misinformation. Our Verify segment clears up all the clutter to let you know what's real. So a viewer asked us to verify whether turning your heat on and off is more cost effective than just leaving it running steady all day long. So our researchers asked AC and heating experts, and they all agree you should not turn your system off completely because it'll have to work extra hard to reheat or recool the house and end up costing you more. Everything in the house cools off. Your furniture, your floors, your walls. Um, then when you come back home, it has to heat all that back up in order to maintain a comfortable temperature. All right, but that doesn't mean you can't bump the temperature down a couple of degrees when you leave the house. The U.S. Department of Energy and Pepco both agree. Setting your house 7 to 10 degrees cooler for an 8-hour period, that'll slash your heating bill by 10%. And Spartan Air Conditioning says you can even drop it down to 55 degrees. So we verified turning your heat on and off is not cost effective in the winter, but turning it down a couple notches can save you big bucks. So there you go. Now you, now you know. All right. If you have something you want us to verify, send an email to verify at 12news.com. You can also reach out to us on our Facebook and Twitter pages as well.